Sue what? Uh, today is the 15th of January. Hmm. It's a male Shih Tzu. Not 11 neutered. years so old, not new set. Okay, okay. Now come back, blend out first, put down first. So, so now, now we go, no, 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 no. We go to the complaint, the owner's complaint. The owner's complaint is that uh, this part is it. Mm. Come here and focus. Well, a bit, a lot now. A lot already. <laughs> so we check when, when it started, how long? Uh, the onset, uh, how long is it? Is it one month, two months? Yeah, about one month, I think. One month. And on, then, on and off, uh, but this time round, uh, a bit more uh, persistent. Okay, so so uh, so this is the duration and when it started? About a month. About a month ago, so the duration is one month. Sometimes better, sometimes worse. Do you apply something? No. You didn't apply anything? Uh, coconut oil. You did apply something? Okay. Yeah, coconut oil. And then you recover? On and off. Right? On and, and off, off. Yeah, yeah. And no other parts of the, of the body no. affected? No. Mm, eye, eye is a bit, eye a bit dry. Eye a bit dry. Okay, this eye is This eye This eye has an ulcer here, then long out, quite long already, so it's all white at the cornea. Mm -hmm. It's a left eye, right? Uh, it's quite common in Shih Tzu's. Uh, uh, right eye a bit. Right, right eye is the starting the eye eyes, uh, uh, okay. Often very red. Uh, uh, and Shih Tzu, they have this problem because the eye is protruding, and they have this hair sticking in. But this complaint is not the eye, right? It's this eye. I have a complaint this. Eye and this, both. Okay, now this one is normally is due to licking. Uh. Yes, yes. That, and you can see this part is swollen. Uh. This is not normal. Uh. Mm. Normally the, the foreskin here is of course not swollen. Uh. So it's been licking. Mm, yes. So one, one possible reason uh, mm. is of course self-stimulation. Uh, we call it hypersex. That means he always stimulate himself. Uh. Did he stimulate himself? No. Did he climb over people's foot, uh, body? Climb the legs? No. Not really. Not really. Pump the pillow? Humping? No. When he was young, uh, quite often, uh, but when nowadays... Hmm? Does he still do it? <laughs> when he played with other dogs, I'm not. <laughs> yeah. I climb with other dogs, so he injured himself. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, then after that, infected, uh, you see, then keep on licking, uh, they see him up to here. Yeah, that's so right. there's one possibility, uh, uh, mm, this, the hypersexuality. Yeah, yeah, and then he lick his yeah. parts here. Yeah. Now, yeah. So although the dog cannot talk, you can see from his, the clues uh, mm. that he probably mm, has some. Uh, does he can he control his bladder? Yeah. Some urination problem because he will not be licking here if there's no urination problem. Uh. He can control the uh, yeah, huh? bladder. Does he right. dribble urine? No. No, but he's been biting. So these are signs of hypersexuality. Uh, that means he's, he's stimulating uh, himself. Mm. Or at night when when everybody's sleeping, I guess. He doesn't do it in front of you, so you <laughs> didn't see. Okay. So this one. Thing. So now we check the, 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 they're normal in size, okay. Normal in size, so that they don't see any cancer or no? any tumor, no, normal in size. Now we check here, now his problem is, uh, does he bite his tail also? No. no. Uh, you can see his anus, uh, it's red also. His anus is red, you know, do you notice? This inner is weak. Oh. A bit like that. Oh, hell, that's so he's been licking it. Uh. So you check the inner glands. And uh, there's no tail biting, you can see the hair is still there. Which the owner says is true, but there's some dandruff here and eh? there. Dandruff, so it should be dandruff. Not much, uh, this weird. I've got to apply the coconut oil. So it might have uh, okay, okay. camouflage. Uh, <coughs> okay, skin. No, no, I can't be second. Let me just check the inner glands. Mm. Have you been rubbing pressure on the floor? No. Chasing yep. the tail? No. Chasing the tail? Running around in circles? No. no. Oh my god. It's going to be very smelly. Wait, wait, wait. Come put down first. Okay. Well, you better, you better don't be a bad one. You better smell. Okay, I wait. squeezed the cat one before. Mm, yeah, so sometimes it's not scared. I'll just talk to you. It went onto my face. Don't okay. okay. the console here. Don't the console here. Okay. Second, second. It's very slow. You all you ever squeeze before? No? Your, your wife want to do? Do you want to practice? So know how to do that. We try. Do you want to practice? Uh. She don't want to do it. Okay. Anyway, you can feel it swollen here. And so you feel it swollen. Here. This one is very much swollen. And you can see the dog has been unhappy with it. So it is. It's been licking it. But sometimes it's very hard to express it. That's kind of second, second. That's the white in colour, isn't it? Yeah, white Yellowish. Color. It's thick, thickened really. Oh. Normally, you like yellow and normal. Yeah. Okay. 
Yeah, but this dog has been doing it himself so that it's not so much. Huh? Not so much. Yes. Okay, so what we have to do is we have to shave what the lower part. Ah. Huh? Just the right side. Yeah. Uh -huh. And a lot of this charge. Right? Okay, now, now we go to the eye uh, examination. Uh, yeah. <coughs> eye examination, I will check for ulcers. The most common is ulcers. Ulcer. Uh, ulcer. So I put the fluorescent dog. Okay. Then, uh, let, me, let me just relax first. Mm. Okay. You're yeah, talking about the right eye only or both eyes? Both. Uh, check both. But the right eye seems more serious. Uh. Right eye is probably recently. Uh. Uh, also, one, two months uh, at least. Hmm? No, la. no, one, two months. Uh, we okay. are at home almost. Uh, quite recently. Uh. Mm. So let, let it diffuse. And if it's green colour, that means there's a recent ulcer. Mm. If no green means it's quite long already. So. But you can see this, the problem is uh, he's been rubbing his eyes. Uh. Oh yeah, a lot. Uh. Huh. Each. Uh. Uh, each year. Uh. And then, uh, before that, how about last year? Last year, okay. Yeah, last year. Hmm? Yeah, it's only recently. We'll have him rest a lot of... Uh, mm. Take care. Mm. Let me just check. Let's put on the table first, so you can ask. You can see the pigmentation quite long really. I have no idea. Oh, this is brown pigment, you see? Can you see the, the whole eye cornea is already clouded with the brown pigment due to long time already. It's called pigmentary keratitis. Huh? Many years already. Uh, of rubbing and scratching. This one, not so bad. This one still can see the cornea. So his right eye is worse now. Mm. Which the owner also knows. This one, the cornea is quite clear. You can still see the cataract. Eh? Okay, now this one you see. Here the ulcer. Green color. Let me see. Why well, you don't cut the hair off? Eh? Sounding the face. This is very causing the trouble. The hair. Now you can see. Okay, the ulcer here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. Where's the ulcer? It's not very really obvious. Okay. You can see the green patches of green oh, okay. at the side, 9 o'clock. Hmm. Okay, 9 o'clock. No, this is uh, yeah, 9 o'clock here from my angle. You can see. Uh. You can see. Uh. Yeah. Okay, then uh, that's why it's quite, quite painful to the light. Uh. Even now you can see more clearly, 11 o'clock or so. This is a recent one. And then some at 3 o'clock, but not, not still a big one. And then below there's a brown one. This is the brown pigmentation. Quite long with scar really. Eh? <coughs> okay, so that's the reason. Uh, I was okay, so This one must have regular ear cleaning. Uh. Do you do regular ear yeah. cleaning? Uh, every week. What do you put in? Could you show you the next one? You can drop now. Mm. From the pet shop one. Yeah, yeah. Uh, from, from doctor, doctor yeah. Mm. What's the name of it? After cleaning, then uh, some ointment. Or... I can't remember. You cannot put so many things in, no? You put one thing in. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, you, you, you put in two types of uh, things. Uh. Uh, water this first, not, then the water first. This one not so bad, uh, is it? Uh, this one is okay. He didn't, he didn't scratch his this side, right? No. No. More, more often than yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. This is not so inflamed when compared mm. with this side. Mm. These are definitely red, okay, reddish, yeah. okay, okay. and then pigmentation. These are the grooves. Huh? This is a chronic. It's dirty, right? This one. No, it's a this a pigmentation. Chronic otitis external. Once you see all this black stuff, huh, it, it shows that this ear is quite long, really scratching. Oh. Oh, very long, several years already. Right? Mm. So that one will be done better with uh, surgery. Last time we opened up. Okay. So the dog is uh, clipboard. Come turn, 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 turn below her and see. Clipboard so that the uh, owner can, can wash the, the skin, clean the skin okay, the, the below and then the ear, uh, flush the ear, both ears, uh, massage, flush and massage. Massage the, the canal there. The canal is here. Massage up and down. Uh. Up and down, this is the vertical ca the lateral canal. Okay. Uh, those give you five, five times range. 45 degrees. Mm. So the dog is under slight sedation, so so he doesn't allow uh, 
Okay. The, the main complaint is not the uh, left ear. Is the left ear? Yeah, it's the left ear. You can see the pigmentation. Is there mm. pigmentation? So there should be some dirt coming out. Yeah. So now this dog, the history of this dog is he has this uh, cornea ulcers due to the hairs and protruding hairs. And uh, so we already cleaned up the eyes, irrigated the eyes to relieve all the, to remove all the, all the dirt, all the dirt. You see this one, the third eyelid, this is the third eyelid. Now this one should have the third eyelid also. There, yeah, the third eyelid is here. So you check the third eyelid, whether there's anything trapped inside the third eyelid. Or not. If there's anything trapped inside the third eyelid, of course, the dog feels very uh, uneasy. So now, we do the ear irrigation. So 45 degrees. The same doesn't come up. This is the so electro canal. So we got the heart to Because the owner put a lot of medication inside. So the thing didn't flow in. Eh? So now I'll do the, the right ear first, uh, the right ear as well. Can I try? <laughs> the right ear now is dirty, right? Not dirty, but just, so you see it's very clean. Can, can I try? See, can compare, huh? Hmm? Can I try? The what? Can I try? To flush. You cannot pop over it. Huh? Oh, yes.